Were you late? Yes, I was. You don't have whatever it takes, leave. This sucked. You're dumb dumb. You didn't bring it. I found three losers. Rejected. Get out of here. Nine years sitting at a desk. You probably don't get up all day except to take a leak. I got a four-year-old could outsell you right now. <laughs> you disappointed me. You suck at selling. You got to get your shit together before you get here. I want to find out where you live when you're put under stress. Oh, I love you. This is going to be crazy. Dude, the guy took his legs off. He showed up with prosthetics. I saw you do things today. I have never seen anyone do. You're going to be challenged, and I'm looking for people that have whatever it takes. I want to put a contest together. We bring people together, and we actually challenge those people against one another. I need people that will go all the way. I need the great people. I'm not talking about their references, their resumes, their grades. All the bullshit will they throw down when they're challenged. I want people that can operate under the gun, under pressure, and in 18 not wins. There's millions of good people out there. This is the worst fucking job market in the history of the United States of America since the Great Depression. Doesn't mean they can come in here and produce. I don't hire on a specific job. I hire on greatness. I'm looking for that whatever it takes quality. I'll find a place for you if you have that. I never ask anybody to do anything I'm not willing to do myself. I got stung by something. He is hardcore. If your toes fall off, not my problem, you understand? He lost his father when he was 10. He lost his older brother when he was 15. I've been going all out, full bore ever since, believing that I too am running out of time. I had one guy believe in me. He believed in me enough to give me a job, to give me a chance, and I've turned that one shot into the rest of my life. And that's what I want to do for other people. I have six kids to feed. I have to get this job. I've been eating peanut butter and jelly two to three days a week. If I don't get this job, I have to leave the country. I'm here to win it. I just don't want to die a nobody. I need to take care of my family. My next stop is bankruptcy. She's got three kids that will go to child services that will be turned over if she gets evicted. You can do this! This is my wife, Elena. Elena loves everyone. He's tough, so I want to be here for you guys. It's not over until you say it's over. No one's going to eat out of a trash can that works for you. How does this apply? There's people that have to go to trash cans. No, the fact that you had some... Can you not the fact put that, a knife at me? Sherry is the CEO of the company. Your time starts now. Jared Glant is 30 years old. Three and a half years ago, he's making 30 grand a year. He'll make over $300,000 this year, maybe closer to 400. Don't quit! This is how bad the job market in America is. There's millions of people unemployed or underemployed, and you don't have your pitch down. Get rid of the ponytail. This job is more important than here. I get paid every damn day. I separate people from their wallet every day. You're getting me excited right now. I'm jacked up. I'm fired up. Go! Oh, look at Grandma. She wants it. Criminal record. I was a train wreck, but I took something and made myself something of it. We could actually find a diamond in the rough. Ah! You done, Kimberly? No. Maybe she's the diamond. Three, two, one. Boom. Four. Dude, he's a 411 assassin. I have no fear. I'm trying to tone it down. Whatever it takes is about me and this company finding great people. Every day I go to work, every day I'm scared. I have been where you've been. 25 years old, I came out of a treatment facility. I was broke and I was broken. You have this hunger that I'm so attracted to, this desperation. All three of them are champions. And frankly, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Don't know who to cut. It's tough. I gotta make the decision. Grandma. You brought in $4. She brought in $14. She brought in $15.50. I love you. You don't have whatever it takes. Uh-uh. Don't give up. You just have to follow your dreams, you know? You have whatever it takes. You win. Oh, my God. I thought I had it. You proved it. Congrats. Congratulations. Literally in shock right now. Hey, babe. I won. No. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, so happy. This guy represents the American dream. Help him every way you can. Whether you get this job or not, what you're learning here will go with you for the rest of your life. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Yeah.